uh, let's talk about this one. Um, what are the values of theta for which two cos theta is greater than negative one and two sine theta is greater than root three? I think it's a good idea if we can rule these out from options one by one. Uh, let's talk about this thing. This looks at least relatively easy to deduce that two sine theta should be greater than root three, which means that sine theta should be greater than root three over two from negative pi to pi. <clears throat> well, if you ask me, I'll just draw a graph because making a graph will be really helpful for us. Negative pi to pi sine is going to look like this. This is pi, this is negative pi. And they need it to be greater than root three over two. And can you tell me where is sine, at which angle is sine root three over two? 60 degree, first angle is 60, which means that 60 is somewhere around this pi over three, because this is pi over two. And another angle at which it is root three over two is in quadrant two. And the quadrant two angle is pi minus pi over three, which is two pi over three. And two pi over three is right here. We want that to be greater than root three over two, which definitely means that we want it to be this. We want it to be this because this is the region where it is greater than root 3 over 2. So our answer is pi over 3 to 2 pi over 3. Correct? Pi over 3 to 2 pi over 3. So anything which is not here cannot be the answer. Obviously, this is not getting satisfied. Pi over 6 onwards cannot be satisfied. Negative 2 over 3 cannot satisfy. It has to be option D. Even without seeing the two cos theta is greater than negative one option or solving that inequality, I know for a fact that it should be option D because that is the only one which is satisfying two sine theta is greater than root three. Yeah. But just for the sake of uh, clarifying, I'll solve two cos theta is greater than negative one as well. Again, I'm going to do the same thing, cos theta is greater than negative one over two. So I'm just going to make sure that in this region, cos theta is negative, greater than negative one over two. Or maybe if I were to make another, another graph, it's uh, going to look like this. This is pi, this is pi over two. This is negative pi over two, and this is negative pi. Okay. Now I want it to be greater than negative one over two, and negative one over two is somewhere over here. So, you know, somewhere over here, somewhere over here, uh, which will give us a value of negative one over two at the second quadrant. Should be pi minus pi over three, right? should be pi minus pi over three, which is two pi over three. So this should be two pi over three, and this should likewise be negative two pi over three. And it should be greater than that. So it means that our favorable area is this, where it is negative, greater than negative one over two. And clearly this red area also takes into account the blue area. In fact, the common intersection of red and blue is just blue. That's why the answer is just option D. Yeah. Makes sense.